read the question. Um, objective. Uh, the diagram on the right shows the shaded regions that specify a few constraints of a situation. By using a suitable value of k, draw a line. k equal to s plus 2y on the graph. On the same graph, draw a straight line parallel to the line k equal to s plus 2y that passes through each point of the vertices of the region. Then find the maximum value and the minimum value. Okay. Now, uh, in this question, in this question, uh, they, they have given you the region, the shaded region. So this is the shaded region here, right? Then there is the, the three points at the three corners here, they are given, right? They are given. So this one, one point here, the coordinate is, is this, right? Then another point, here the coordinate is given another point at the corner here the vertex uh, the vertex here the coordinate is given now inside this shaded region here there are many points other than these three points at the vertex there other than these three points at the vertex there inside this shaded region there are many points each point that you use Right, each point that you let's say 15a. I use 15a, I substitute into this maximum or minimum function. This function is called the objective function 2x uh, x plus 2y. So if I take one point, I substitute into this x plus 2y, I will get a value. I take another point here, I substitute inside this function x plus 2y, which is called the the objective function i will get another value so different points will give rise to different values so of all these points which point will give you the maximum value which point will give you the minimum value for this function okay so that is what we want to find out hmm? this function is called the objective function okay so first of all, uh, the, the region is given. So I want to... Wait, uh, I, I see where, no more. Uh. Okay. I want to... Okay. Uh, I want to look at this objective function. Okay. So let the objective function be K. This is the function that I want to find the value. So I call this function k. k equals to x plus 2y. So again, I make y the subject of the formula. That means I change everything to y equals to mx plus c. So the gradient is negative half. Oh, there is another one. This, this one is divided by k. k over 2. It's not k, it's k over 2, right? Hmm k over 2 because you divide by 2 everything is divided by 2 okay so this i get the gradient from here so i'm going to plot this gradient near the near the origin okay so it is 1 over 2 so can you see this 1 over 2 here this one sorry this one here is one unit here is two units one ratio la, one two right so i plot this the gradient of this objective function here the gradient of the objective function then i place a ruler there okay so this first ruler i'm going to place on this objective function on top of this dotted line that i have plot this red dotted line it comes from the gradient it comes from the gradient of the objective function right? i place the first ruler there then after that i put another ruler right perpendicular to the first ruler okay i put the second ruler here and i slide the first ruler 
the green color ruler along the gray color ruler. Right? Now you see that this green color ruler it hits the yellow region. The first point that it hits is the point here. Can you see the arrow that I'm pointing? This is the first point. Now, as I move the green ruler further up, the green ruler hits the yellow region at many, many points. So this will give rise to one value for K. As I move further, uh, there are many points that I hit. So each point on this ruler will give rise to one value of K. Then I move some more. Uh, then you see I, I hit this corner here again. I hit the corner. So as I move the ruler higher and higher, the value of K will become bigger and bigger. So which at which point the value of K will become the highest? Ah, this point here. So this point is furthest away from the origin. Furthest away from origin. And this point will give the maximum value for the objective function K. Right? Then if I want the minimum value, I pull the ruler back. I pull the ruler back. Hmm. Uh, this is I can go further some more. I can go down, down some more, down some more because I'm still inside the yellow region. The last point that I'm going to hit is this point here. So this point here will give rise to the minimum value of k. This point will give rise to the minimum value of k. Now, if you look at what I have shown you here, right? Now, when this objective function k equals to x plus 2y. So as I move 